what God wants to hear where I, I made it here. And it was funny, I was gonna make a rock record, come back here and make my solo rock and roll record. And instead it was a, you know, a sort of a contemporary Christian album that I did. And, uh, and it happened very quickly and the Lord gave me all these songs in a hurry. And so I didn't have time to check with anybody. I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna go do this. I have these great session guys. So I came in here and I did what God wants to hear. And based on the idea that I was gonna try to put the word back into into to worship, you know. And I said to Paula, being such a, a scripture master, she knows the Bible inside and out. And I said, you know, there's hardly any scripture in any of these songs, you know, the Bible's nowhere to be found. And, uh, and God's calling me to put that back into the music, you know. You know, when I think about um, a worship Christmas, uh, it, it almost has to include the idea that he came down for us. What I wanted to really look at was the salvation piece, you know, and, 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 and that's what I have been, you know, really discovering in Christmas that, that the greatest gift that we could ever have is, is our salvation, you know. We can't take it lightly. You know, when Christmas comes around, um, I want people to surrender, you know, to the salvation piece because, um, you know, it's, it's time to get on your knees. That's the time, you know, pray on your knees um, and forget about the commercial part of Christmas, but, but honor the birth of our Christ. I'm excited about uh, our new single that we're releasing for Christmas, Wonder of Wonders. And I'm excited that we're able to play it live for you, along with uh, this album, Unsung Noel. And we have some special surprises along the way, that some instrumental things that'll blow your mind. And I can't wait to see you on the Don't Stop Believing Family Christmas Tour.